for workflow notification and that could be send an email to whoever is responsible party for it. So I can specify a submission instruction and I call it change management demo. I click close. Now at this stage, I can save and close and I can specify a more descriptive version information on it and click OK and activate it immediately. By going through this, now I've created my workflow. As soon as this workflow is completed, I can switch back to the list of existing workflows and close this template and refresh it. And as you see, the workflow has been created for SRHQ. It's company specific. You could create as many as workflows within the same template as you like, but you could make only one of them to be default. Needless to say, you could export this workflow from one environment and import it to another. So you don't have to redesign it and you could delete it or copy it. Or you could simply import it from another environment into this one. After you did this, I'm going to go back and create a brand new purchase order for the guide to learn as a vendor. And here I enable the active change management and I click OK. This time, as you notice, something interesting has happened. There is a button of a workflow has been enabled for me. Unlike the previous purchase order, if I go back to number, let's say 25, the workflow button is not there. But 27, the workflow is available. Now, if I close the show list, I'm just going to go about and select an item. This time I'm picking and choosing, let's say, a different item like ebook white case. And intentionally, I put in the value of 15 at the price of $6.99. To begin with, you notice that on the purchase tab, I cannot confirm this anymore. And on the purchase order itself, the request change is not enabled either. And if you also take a look at the inventory, take a look at the transaction, there would be no inventory transaction created because it has to be approved. And because of that, if I go to the arrival overview and update this, there would be no indication of that purchase order in your warehouse.